Hello, my name is Mike Keenis at the White Bear Lake Superstore in White Bear Lake, Minnesota. And uh, today we're going to go over the uh, extended wheelbase GMC Savannah van. It's a Quigley 4x4, has a 3 inch lift on it, Bilstein shocks, Helwig sway bar, uh, rides great. Um, my lifted vans uh, definitely ride better than a standard van, there's no doubt about that. Uh, so looking at the van right now, it, it kind of looks ugly. I, I would agree with that. It has the stock rims and tires on it. It's in the raw. It's waiting to be uh, waiting to be bought by a happy customer out there. And the reason I order them this way and build them out, now the inside of the van is all done. This one's kind of unique and we'll get to that in a minute. But uh, the reason I do this is because everybody has little different things they want to do with the van. And especially when you get to a lifted van, you want bumpers, uh, what kind of wheels, tires you want, uh, do you want a custom grill, that kind of thing. Because I can always put wraparound ground effects on it if you want to do all that as well. But uh, so just don't look at the rims and tires from now in the video and uh, we'll be fine. So let's just move along here. Um, so I try to always put the bumper cover on here. Uh, my kind of idea with this, if you've seen some of my other videos, probably do my Rhino on the grill or on the bumper, I should say, and uh, finish it off that way. But whatever you really want in the van, we can do. Um, so coming around the side of the van, one of the things that I I always do even when I don't put the ground effects on is I put the amp research boards on because we have the three inch lift so it gives you a nice transition into the van. Um, so this van is an extended van, like I said. It's set up uh, as a seven passenger van. So let's take a peek inside real quick and we're gonna go inside the van after we're done with the outside but we'll take a peek real quick. I'll open up the doors here. So it has seating for seven, and you'll see why in a minute here. So when we look right over against the wall over there, that's where our DVD player are, is going to be, our, our heat controls, our game prep, that kind of thing. The reason we do that is if we notice it has no center console. So it has a free flow back, no restrictions right there. Everything's tucked away um, right in the sidewall right there. So it has a great look. It's out of the way. It gives it a little bit more room. So we can do that on any van that we'd custom make. Uh, seats are on quick release brackets, swivel, that kind of thing. So that kind of explains a little bit about what's going on inside this fan. So uh, close that up. Our board's going to go up here. Coming around to the back. Quickly 4x4. Four four. This little apparatus right here, I put that in this van. Again, this van is not sold as of yet. But what that is, that's shore power. So if I have a generator, or if I pull up somewhere where there's power, I can power the whole interior of my van right from there. So I have a converter in there that's gonna power everything up. So this is the best part of this van. If we look back here, we have a lot of cargo room. So what we did is we built a seven passenger van. We took the sofa and we moved it all the way up as far as we could um, with still everything functioning. And so you have a lot of cargo room back here. So we're going to fold down the bed. It's a three-way power folding sofa. This is going to fold down here. And what we're going to have is we're going to have our full bed right at that point. And we can swivel those chairs around there too to get a little bit more room. But we still have all this room back here. Um, right here we have our outlet for our shore power right here. So this is a 120 volt outlet that's coming in. We have our vacuum right here. We have our jack right here. Um, over there we have our uh, rear condenser. So I'll fold this back up here. And there we go on that one. So that's kind of how that works. We'll I'll shut up the doors. So this is the limited XSE package. It has a traditional roof on it. The difference between a traditional and a Vista Cruiser roof is this has storage on the side and no glass on the side. Um, so set up with the tow package, 9,500 pound towing capacity, transmission cooler, oil cooler. It's all there and it's ready to go. Four pin and seven pin. Again, this is a Quigley 4x4 van. Quicksilver metallic. And uh, let's just get a shot of the roof real quick so they can see the difference. So. Traditional roof, and we'll just pan right over here. We have another van sitting on the showroom floor. Just so you see the difference right away. This is a uh, Vista Cruiser roof right here. 
So that's the difference between the two. So I'll get back over on our van right here, open up the driver's door, little amp research board comes out, again an LED light underneath. I'm going to hop right in here. Now a lot of times what we do in our vans, I'm 6'1", it can be pretty tight here. So I have the seat all the way back right now, we have seat extenders in here which bring that back quite a bit more. We can drop them down too to give you a little bit more uh, headroom too if you have a longer torso. So uh, why don't we jump on inside the van, we'll go through some of the features and benefits of the van. Here we are inside of this beautiful uh, GMC Savannah van. Uh, again, it's a 2017 GMC Savannah with a Quigley 4x4 on it with a 3 inch lift from Quigley. Uh, it has an Explorer limited XSE package. Uh, it's an extended van, but we set this one up as a 7 passenger van. Um, so the first thing is, is notice that there's no center console right here. Um, as we showed you earlier in the video, everything is over here on the side. Um, so it's out of the way, so we have a nice walkway right here to get, get, uh, get in between. Um, we have our heated seats, our power lumbar right here. Eight-way po eight power with, uh, with the recline. We have our 4x4 four four shifter right here. It is shift on the fly, so all we have to do is uh, basically just shift it in the four-wheel drive. Notice our 4x4 four four light comes on right there. Um, so steering wheel right here, all our steering wheel controls are right here. Our volume, um, our push to talk, um, obviously the radio is Bluetooth, everything like that. Cruise on this side. And uh, our tow haul button with transmission cooler, oil, oil cooler, that kind of thing. Uh, 12 volt right here, traction control stability track. And uh, this one does have the navigation on it, which all of them are going to have on it that uh, we do here at the Superstore. Um, our OnStar, um, again our 4x4 indicator from Quigley. 120 volt outlet that's running off the chassis. USB and another 12 volt. Up here we have our uh, lower end direct ceiling lights, our ceiling direct lights and our cabinet light in the back. Uh, heat controls here, we have a map light up here. Um, so these are on a dimmer switch, a really nice when you're driving, give your uh, people in the back a little bit to see and uh, it really doesn't bother the driver too much. Um, all the speakers in this van have been upgraded to uh, JL Audio. Um, so it does have a great sound and it has subs underneath the seat that's going to give it quite a bit better sound too. Not over the top, but just to uh, get a little bit better sound. Um, when we go back here, I just want to show you here, we have a traditional sport roof right here. So what we have is we have storage up here and it's lighted as well. Um, we do have our dimmer switch right here. So this is going to go up and down right here for our light panel up on top. Um, we have our sunroof in the back. That sunroof is going to close automatically uh, when the key is taken out of the ignition. So if the kids or adults, for that matter, leave it open, it will close. You won't have to worry about the, uh, the rain and that kind of thing. Um, up top here we have, uh, we'll get a shot of this, we have our 29-inch Samsung TV, uh, JBL audio speakers right here, and uh, we have two more in the back back here, uh, door tweeters. JBL Audio as well. And uh, again, our game prep, HDMI, our uh, switch for our speakers, and then our uh, Blu-ray player right in the bottom. Lighted drink holders right here. So you can see them as you're rolling down the road. Our blinds, very quiet. A lot of privacy right there. Um, so, again, my name is Mike Keenis at the White Bear Lake Superstore. If you're looking for a customized van, if you're looking for a four-wheel drive van, I have more vans in stock and in production than anyone else in the country, let alone the world. So uh, definitely give me a call. Let's build out a van and uh, we'll go from there. My cell phone number is 763-607-5179. Have a great day and let's build the van of your dreams.